Diamond jumps are a very advanced plyometric move, and I would highly advise you to make sure that you are capable and ready strength-wise before you attempt this move. There aren't many modifications that really give you a leg up into the movement, such as doing squats, then pull squats, little baby jump squats, going into rocket jumps, etc. So make sure that you have a really good foundation of squatting and jumping before attempting this. You're going to want your legs roughly shoulder width um, apart, a little bit wider, and then angled out a tiny bit. I'm going to start with the, um, the modified non-jumping version, and then I'm going to go into the jumping version just to show you how you can build momentum into it. So you're going to cross your arms as you squat down, and then stand up to one side, cross there like so. So all I'm doing is just building my momentum. This is the modified version, but again, I don't think that it really helps you all that much in building your strength to do the actual move. Now here comes the pull. So I'm touching both my feet and my hands together as I'm coming off the ground. I'm still landing nice and soft into my good squat position. Remember, careful, land soft, land correctly. This is a fantastic exercise, very difficult to do. Have fun with it. This is the diamond jumps.